Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today's video is a hot tent adventure with the truck and this time I am not alone. I got two little girls with me and we're gonna have a blast. Now I've got a truck loaded full of gear and full of goodies. I've got to get all this out. Girls are gonna help me set up and then we're gonna start enjoying some camp life. So let's get all this stuff out and get it set up. Alright guys, we've got the tent set up and it's looking really good right where it's at. Hopefully it's level enough inside to sleep. Now I have camped here many times before with large tents and that is exactly why I chose this location to come to because I figured it would be a good fit for that tent. So the girls are over playing by the fire pit right now, kind of digging up rocks and looking for some small pieces of wood. I'm going to get the stove assembled and get this inside of the tent and get everything situated. So we've got all of our bedding in here. We've got tons of stuff. We've got bedding, sleeping bags, sleeping pads. I even brought my big wooden chest. That guy's full of treats. We're gonna use that both as a sitting bench and as a tabletop inside of the tent. So multi-purpose item would be pretty awesome. I chose to bring a very large wood stove with us to strip with a very large window for the girls so they can sit back and enjoy the flames inside of the tent later on. And I think that'll make for a really great atmosphere. So I'm just going to build this stove up, get it over to the tent and finish the inside of the assembly of the tent, sleeping area stove and everything totally finished.
All right, guys, we've got everything in the tent totally set up. And as you guys can see, the girls have already made it towards their bed. They are sitting on over five inches of mattress material. That is the mattress out of the back of my truck camper. So it's very, very thick. They're going to be super warm. I've got two wool blankets on top of that as well. And then they've got a big old down top quilt, which will bury them. Is that nice and warm? So they're going to be plenty warm there tonight plus they've got a big pillow up top and you got room for your shoes up there as well now back here we brought a large trunk this is a very nice trunk that was personally made for me and i'm actually very happy it is full of treats and snacks so we've got coffee we've got hot chocolate i brought all kinds of goodies treats and snacks that are inside of there including a few bottles of water so we have quick access. We've got all of our cooking utensils over here, so all of our cups and all of our pots, everything is all ready to go. I've got a USB battery bank set up here with two light bulbs way up top, so the tent's gonna light up like crazy tonight. Yeah. And then, of course, we've got the wood stove. So I did bring a silicone mat to place just on top of this floor in case any embers do fall out. This is basically stove jack material, so it won't burn anything. But I brought a very large stove and I positioned it this way so the girls, when they're laying down, they can see in the front window and in the side window. Now for me, later on this evening, I think I could probably squeeze in here with my air mattress. If not, I'm actually going to come right back here, move this trunk out of the way, and I'll sleep this way with my head up here. That way I can kind of keep track of where they are in the night because I don't want anyone going towards the stove. So all in all, what do you girls think? Does it look good? Yeah. Pretty good. So, you know what we need to do now? What? We need to get your boots back on. Okay. We need your hats on because it is hunting season. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And we need to go and get some firewood. So that means we need to go collect some, use okay. the saw, split it up because we need a campfire for what? To make marshmallows. Marshmallows and hot dogs. So let's go get some firewood. Okay. All right, so the last time that I camped here, I have a ton of firewood that I already cut and split, and I didn't end up burning it all. So there's a whole bunch right here. And then over by Autumn, we have a pile of firewood that we actually brought from home. Me and Brooke just grabbed, gathered that out of the truck a few moments ago. So you wanna hold up a piece of that, Autumn? Yep. We brought some nice pine. So we got some nice soft wood here that'll burn really fast. And then this stuff over here is all hardwood. And there's even more of it behind me so the campfire this evening is going to be for basically cooking we're going to do hot dogs and marshmallows over the campfire yeah. and then we're going to do the rest of the cooking inside of the tent and for the fuel for the inside of the tent we're actually not going to be burning wood i brought compressed wood bricks just to keep it a little bit more comforting so we don't have to bust our butts all day collecting firewood so we are cheating a little bit we're going to collect a little bit of wood for an outdoor fire, inside firewood is already taken care of, and we have a treat. We got a big surprise for you girls tonight for entertainment. So you guys stick around for that because this is going to be awesome. And uh, I'm gonna have to reposition the truck for that, but more on that later on. So let's go collect some more wood. Brooke, you already got the saw? Yeah. All right, let's get this put together. And we're gonna cut up some of these pieces of wood around here, okay? okay. There's one for Brooke. That big one. Autumn, I got one for you up here. There you go. Careful. Grab the dry part. There you go. Yeah. Keep going. 
got it? Yeah. Good job. It's a little tricky, huh? Yeah. Keep practicing with it. Okay. There you go. Watch your fingers. help all right guys we're just ducking inside of the tent right now for a water break we got all of our wood cut and split and ready to go Brooke even tried using the saw a little bit now that saw has a brand new blade on it so it's very very aggressive on a cut and it bites in really really hard it's actually a little tricky for me to use let alone her but she still did a great job you got one or two pieces cut yeah. you got one cut yeah. so Good enough try. Autumn broke off all the little branches on the on the sticks that we were cutting with the saw. Want me to put that up here? Mm -hmm. So Autumn did a great job breaking off the sticks and we've got all of our wood ready to go. So the sun is repositioning in the sky. It's probably about another two hours to maybe an hour and a half before it starts dipping below the tree line and we get that beautiful golden glow in the forest. Mm -hmm. Now we, there is one thing we need to do still. Yeah. We've got all those compressed logs inside of the tent. Yeah. That's going to be our firewood for tonight. Mm -hmm. But how are we going to cook our hot dogs and marshmallows? The fire out there. The, the fire, fire out, out there. there, but what do we need? Wood. We need sticks. Yeah. sticks. So we need to go get some hot dog and marshmallow sticks. So girls, you're going to need your shoes back on. Okay. Do you want to take another drink before we go? Yes. You want one more drink <laughs> on your bum? So another little quick drink. Make sure we got our hats on. Yep. And we're going to go collect some marshmallow and hot dog sticks. Yeah. Run those in the tent. You want to try, Brooke? Really hard. Stand up and try it. There you go. Harder. Get 
out at it. Angry. Hit it. All right. Here you go, Autumn. Got another one, Brooke.
Okay guys, so we're taking a little bit of a coffee break right now inside of the tent and uh, I should mention I'm having coffee, they are not having coffee. They're having hot cocoa which is actually really good. I stole a sip out of one of their cups and it was really good. So it is much later in the day now. As you could probably notice, Brooke is feeling the night air setting in. Autumn's still nice and warm, but we do have to start on supper. So that means we need to get out of the tent and we need to light the campfire. I believe Brooke's going to help me with that. And Autumn's going to help me with the wood stove tonight. Yeah. Right? So we've got that worked out. Our game plan right now is we're going to get the fire going. We're going to cook up our hot dogs, do our supper routine outside of the tent. And then we're going to make our way inside of the tent because the sun is setting. So hopefully it'll be dark around that time. We're getting dark at that time. At that point in time, we're going to get the wood stove going. And then I actually have to reposition the truck for our surprise this evening, which is going to be a fun one. So we're going to get changed into pajamas before we do that. Mm -hmm. And uh, you guys will see what happens after that because it's going to be pretty awesome. I got to reposition the truck in front of the tent. I got a few things to move around and uh, get the stove going. And you guys will see what, uh, what the entertainment is for this night. So let's finish up our hot drinks and then get over towards the campfire and get that going and get some hot dogs cooked up and eat some okay. supper. Okay? okay? Yeah. All right. Yeah.
All right, guys, we just finished up with supper and two thumbs up on that. How did you girls like your hot dog? Good, really good. Good and a really good. So definitely good supper time. There are a lot of clouds in the sky and they seem to be moving this way, which is going to block the sunshine. So who knows, it might actually rain this evening. It is getting a little bit windy and the night air is setting in nice and cool. This campfire is very nice and warm. So we're gonna relax our bellies because we just finished eating. We're gonna relax right here for a few more moments. And then I think we're gonna change gears into moving the truck over to get ready for tonight's entertainment and get the wood stove inside of the tent burning. What do you get, what do you think about that? Good. Good? Yeah. Good. So we'll soak up some of this heat for a few more moments and then we'll carry on with our evening. Right, guys well with the girls roasting their marshmallows over the campfire I'm going to reposition the truck basically right here on a sideways angle and this is going to be really interesting guys so I'm just gonna fire up the truck move it position it here and then open up the front door to the tent close the other side door and get ready for tonight
hold that for a second. Put this up here. Alright guys, well here is my big surprise. The girls are going nuts over this right now. I have a gigantic screen and a projector to watch a Halloween movie as today is Hallow's Eve. So tomorrow is Halloween, which means we're going to watch a Halloween movie out here in the woods in the hot tent with the wood stove plastered all along the side of the truck. So. It is not dark enough yet to get this going, so I'm just getting everything calibrated, making sure everything is good. I have movies pre-downloaded on my phone, and I have purchased a cable that can run my phone to the projector and basically run any copyrighted content, which is a bonus because anything you download is copyrighted. So there's actually software in the projector that will not play it. Now that I'm streaming it off my phone, running through the cable, it actually plays it no problem. So. This is our entertainment for the evening, guys. We're gonna continue getting ready. We still have to close one tent door, uh, rearrange the inside of the tent, get our treats and snacks out, and then we're gonna roll into movie night. All right, guys, so I've got the movie rigged up on the screen right now, and we're just ready to dive into this movie. Now, I can't show any of it to you because my channel will get copyrighted. So I just paused the movie. Yeah, all that fun stuff. So we've got the wood stove crackling in the background here. The heat is rolling out of the tent. I closed the back door. Girls, you've got chips. You've got your hot cocoa over there. Got some headlamps. Yeah. What do you say we start this movie and shut these lights off? Yeah. All right, guys, it's movie time. Girls want to watch their movies, so we'll check in with you guys as soon as we're all done watching. All right, guys, we just finished up with our movie, and as you guys can see, Autumn is sound asleep. She passed out, what, halfway through the movie? Probably. She was out pretty quick, so she's asleep, sound, and just totally out. Brooke is getting ready for bed right now. Uh, might not go to sleep yet. Probably lay down and watch the flicker and flames in the stove yeah. for a little bit. Uh, we're, we're probably gonna have a drink of water, maybe a snack and whatnot, and then off to bed. But we do want to get this door shut. Uh, I just packed away the projector and the truck is totally locked up. Everything's good. I've got my bedding just set up here. Got my mattress and my sleeping bag ready to go. I did get a down sleeping bag out for Brooke. So she has her own and Autumn's wrapped up in the top quilt by herself. So that should kill any cold spots coming in underneath the tent. I think we'll all be plenty warm. That stove is putting out a lot of heat, and as soon as that door shuts, it's going to get really hot in here. Really hot. So we're going to say goodnight to you guys now, and I'm going to stoke that stove, shut the door, and we're going to go off to bed shortly. Like I said, we're probably just going to lay around talking a little bit, yeah. and then off to bed. So you're going to say goodnight? Goodnight. Goodnight, guys, and we'll see you in the morning. Good morning, guys. It is a very early morning today. It is still dark outside, and if you guys can tell or not, it is extremely windy. The whole tent's just been rocking for the last four or five hours. It is now raining as well. You girls hear that? Yeah, yeah we heard it when we were so outside. Yeah. Quite a bit of blowing rain coming off. In it, it, It's off and on. It hasn't been steady yet, but... I think we're going to get dumped on. The winds came in last night just after our movie. We had fun watching that. Autumn, you fell asleep during the movie. Yeah? Yeah. yeah. At the end? No, at the beginning. <laughs> Halfway. It's all right. We'll watch it again when we get home, okay? Yes. Today's Halloween. Yeah. Trick-or-treating yeah, tonight. I know that. You know that? Yeah. So, girls are going to go trick-or-treating tonight mm -hmm. with, uh, with the brothers. Okay. We got to get home and we got to get cleaned up. So, right now, we have to get hot drinks. We need to get breakfast ready. Food, Food yep. yeah. And I have to go to the truck to get all that stuff. So I got to run outside. The stove is stoked and ready to go. The tent is all secure. I've already yep. been outside, went around, did up all the guy lines. Yeah. 
and uh, you girls find something to play with, okay? Stay away from the stove. I'm just going to run to the truck and get some food. So let's get some food, guys. Okay guys, so we're just getting ready to have some hot drinks and the wind is crazy. I've got to hold this wall to the tent back because it's blowing in so hard. So girls, give yours a little taste test. Careful because it's going to be hot. You want to wait a little bit? Okay. All right. How about, <laughs> here comes the wind. <laughs> it's very, very windy. Uh, how about we take our drinks and we'll put them down on the ground. We'll put them back here on the ground, away from the, away from the heat. Okay. Way back there, they'll cool down quicker. If you girls jump up on the bed there, I'm going to cut up some fruitcake, and I'm going to start cooking some breakfast.
right guys, well breakfast is ready. Autumn has perched herself directly in front of the fruit cake and her hot chocolate. Do you like the fruit cake, Autumn? Yeah. Is it good? Mm -hmm. All kinds of colors in there. Now, Brooke does not like fruit cake. She actually really does not like fruit cake. So, we brought a big old pack of pepperoni sticks for Brooke because that's what she likes. How do you like those? Good. <laughs> no one's allowed touching those. So we've got our hot chocolates, our coffee on the go. The fire is burning really strong right now. I just finished up those uh, sausage medallions. I don't think anyone wants any. You don't want any? No. You, I don't. you don't want any? Okay, yeah. so I guess I'm gonna eat all of that cheddar sausage to myself. Yeah. A little bit of fruitcake and my yeah. coffee. Yeah. We're just gonna do breakfast inside of the tent. Yeah. And then we're gonna start the pack up process, guys. So we'll catch up yeah. with you as soon as we're done breakfast. Mmm. Look at that one. Wee. Daddy. Okay guys, so breakfast is all finished up and as you guys can see, we've already started cleaning out the tent. We've got the stove and all the furniture, everything is out of here except for the ground sheet and the actual tent itself. So these girls are gonna jump inside of the truck. I'm gonna warm it up while I take the tent down in the wind. It's not gonna be fun, so I'm just gonna try and do that really quickly off camera. Did you girls have fun? Yeah. Did you have fun on them? Yeah. You got to cook hot dogs, marshmallows, we had fun in the tent, and you guys got to watch that movie on the side of the truck. Yeah. yeah. Pretty cool? Yeah. All right, girls, say goodbye to those guys. Bye. Peace out, guys, and I'll see you in the next adventure.